All right, so unfortunately we got Chris's engine right here. Uh, we got it all unpackaged and on an engine stand. And I realized real quick that it's actually not a six liter iron block, but a five three block. So that's not gonna work out for us just because we want him to have some big cubes so he can spool up those turbos quick. You can see here, it's a four eight five three. It is, it is indeed an iron block, but you can't take this out as much as you can a uh, iron six liter block. So. We're just going to go ahead and uh, push this off into the back corner and we're going to go ahead and get him set up with one of our resleeve Texas speed blocks. All right, so Jaime got all the machining finished up on the block. Now it's headed over to Ryan to get honed. So let's go check it out. So he's gonna go ahead and bolt these torque plates on it here. They simulate the uh, torque of the head because it actually stretches the block when you torque a head on there. So we wanna make sure it's honed exactly like it'll be when the head is on there. So he'll go through and do a pass over all of them to get him to about 1,000th to uh, the size he's looking for and uh, that causes a lot of heat in the block so he'll let it cool down and then come back and do that final thousand just to make sure you know it doesn't uh, change once it cools down so all right so that's gonna take ryan a while to get that all done we'll come back and check up on it here in a little while all right so mario got the weights added here now it's time to get the reluctor on get it back on here and make sure it's all balanced up all right, so we're about to balance Chris's crank here. So we went with a dart center counted weighted crank. Uh, Mario already got these uh, bob weights set up to the exact piston and rod weight that he's going to be running here. He's going to go ahead and get them screwed on here and get this balanced up. Alright, so Mario got this all finished up. You can see he got it dialed in here by taking just little bits of weight out here and there. Drilled them out, got it perfect. So this bad boy is balanced up and ready to rip. Alright, so we're back at it this Monday morning, working on Chris's engine, getting it done into him quick. They told me it's just in the Align Hone, so we're going to head over here and uh, check it out. so the outside two were perfect the inside three just needed a tiny speck so they got it done now they'll get the block cleaned up and uh, get it in the build room all right so here it is all cleaned up from the line hone looks like they got the bearings in it all lubed up ready for the uh, dart center weighted crank all the main caps all cleaned up and also ready to go All right, so the short block's all finished up. Looking good. Looking ready for some big power. Now time to head over here. 
get the long block finished up. So he's going with these LS3 260cc heads to mate up to the intake we sent him, the billet runner one you guys have already seen probably on his channel. We got a nice boost cam here. This might be the first Lamborghini engine that's come out of Texas Speed right here, so. It's gonna be cool to see this project done. We're finishing up this engine as quick as possible to get it headed his way. Chris's engine all finished up here, ready to ship out. It's about to uh, head out the door to him here in a couple hours. They gotta build the crate, get it all set up. But uh, yeah, here it is, pretty much finished up. So a little bit of info on the engine here. It's, uh, it's got our Texas Speed uh, billet I-beam rods. We went with a Dart center weighted crankshaft. It's got Wiseco pistons. It's a Texas Speed uh, resleeve LS block, 430 cubic inch overall. And uh, we went with a set of PRC 260 LS3 heads. It's got the ARP main studs and uh, half inch head studs here. Uh, we went with the black Texas Speed valve covers with the gray lettering. We figured it'd look pretty good on there. So yeah, this thing's uh, pretty much ready for some big power. Uh, intake wise, he's gonna be running our, our Texas Speed Billet Runner, which we have right here on this engine. So it basically looks just like this. He's already got it at the shop because he was mocking some stuff up with it with, for the setup. So he's already got that. We sent him a black um, Boost uh, 102 throttle body. So he'll have that on there ready to go. And uh, yeah, that's pretty much it. So we got the compression right around 10.5 to one. Should be pretty good for the boost setup give him some good uh, street manners and also he can use pump gas on this setup which will be nice um yeah other than that i think it's uh, pretty much ready to ship out we'll get it headed, headed his way and i uh, can't wait to see the twin turbos set up on this you know I, he talked about how he's going to run the headers up and run the turbos up somewhere like this coming out the hatch so that's going to look really good yeah i just can't wait to see this bad boy running overall so uh, thanks for choosing us for your engine build chris and hope you like it <laughs>